everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Melissa. So, today I'm going to be unboxing the Flick the Wick, I believe it's a dystopian life, I think that's the theme. So, I am really excited about this box because honestly, like dystopian is one of the things that got me into reading and I just love dystopian so much. So I am so there for this box and so excited for it. It's finally here. Um, I love that the quote in the back is uh, from the Hunger Games and it says, you don't forget the face of the person who was your last hope. I love that. So I am so excited to open this box. So we're just gonna get right into it. Flick the Wicks, a candle company that does bookish candles. They do a monthly box. I don't know what else to tell you. I'll link it down below if you want to go and check them out. Uh, I'm not affiliated with them or anything. I bought the box and I want to open it for you guys. So it's always so nice looking. So that is what we're looking at. I think I'm going to pull this one out first. Oh my gosh, it, oh, it's a tote bag. It's Hunger Games and says, maybe I'll be ever in your favor. Oh my gosh, I love this. It's gorgeous. Give you guys a closer look. It is gorgeous. Oh, it's so pretty. I love this. I love this tote. This is my new favorite tote. Then the next thing I'm pulling out is this, I don't even know what this is. Oh, oh, uh, this is hand sanitizer. It says true love is usually the most inconvenient kind and it's from the selection series. But it's like a, a spray sanitizer. That is unique and super cool. I've never seen this before. So I'm really liking it smells really good too um so yeah that's that's just so neat okay now I see okay so this is a magnet I believe and this is actually from the legend series which I have not read yet and I want to it says it hurts every day the absence of someone who was once there so that's really pretty that will go on my fridge and then we get um some wax melts wax melts and this is wicked is good i'm not sure what this is from pomegranate blackberry citrus jasmine and musk actually that doesn't smell that doesn't smell bad you can really smell the jasmine in it but it's not bad you get the citrus too so this is their big candle they always include one of the big candles and this is June and Day, Citrus, Cranberry, and Apple. Oh, that smells so good. That smells so good. It smells so fruity. And there's the label. Super cute. And it's just plain blue on the inside. It smells so good. I'm not sure what that's from. So let me see if I can find this spoiler card. A dystopian future, that's the theme, what the theme was. Uh, June and Day is from the Legend series, which a series I have not read. And then this one is, oh, this is inspired by the Maze Runner. I don't know if I showed you that, but that's what that is. Okay, on to the three little candles that we get, and I'm already loving these. Come on out. My leg came off of the one. Okay, so the first one is Maxton, and it's from the Selection series, and it's black cherry, amber, oak, and red wine. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. That smells good, and it's just like a plain color candle. There's the label. The next one is the Mock and Jay, and it's raspberry, patchouli, chocolate, and fire. Oh, I don't really smell the chocolate. I do smell like the patchouli. 
and a little bit of the raspberry scent but I don't really smell the chocolate at all and it's just like an orange candle but look at the label and the last one is Dauntless the Brave and it's leather oak, mo oak moss and black currant smells really fresh and clean it smells really good and it's actually a black candle because of Dauntless <laughs> It, smell, it smells very fresh and clean. And there is the label. Okay, so moving on to an arch print. Each day means a new 24 hours. Each day means everything's, everything's possible again. You live in the moment. You die in the moment. You take it all one day at a time. I'm not sure where that quote's from, so I'm gonna look at this. Doesn't say. It's really pretty, it doesn't say. But it is by Marie Luke, so I'm thinking maybe Legend, or what's the other series that she has? The Young Elites maybe, I don't know. And then on this side we have Warner and Juliet. That's really pretty. It's really cute. And then we get a bookmark. Oh, yes. We get a diversion quote on one side. It says, fear doesn't shut you down. It wakes you up. I love that. And it's got like the ravens on it and everything. Oh. And then there's Hunger Games on the other side. You don't forget the face of the person who was your last hope. Oh, my gosh. I love it. I love this bookmark. It's got two of my favorite dystopian series on it. Oh, I love it. And then this one is from Shatter Me. And it's a notebook. And it's super cute. It says, I spent my life folded between the pages of a book. And that is so pretty. And oh my goodness, it's so cute. It's plain. But look, it says, it's like my love love that that is a cute touch so and then the last thing is this art print which is the spoiler card and it says I don't need to relive my fears anymore all I need to do now is try to overcome them and that's a divergence um, quote from that series that is cool so anyways that was everything that was in this box I I'm in love with this box. Honestly, I love everything about it. The only series that I did not read is the Legend series. Yeah, well, Maze Runner too. I I started read, reading the Maze Runner, but then I just didn't finish it. I got kind of bored with it. But I have to go back and visit it, it looks like. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. Uh, let me know uh, what you guys thought of this box. And if you guys like dystopians like I do, um, Hit me up in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And that's all I have for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.